Welcome to Healthy Living. So glad to have you here. I'm glad that you stopped by to spend some time with me. And if this is your first time here, I'm so glad to have you. Today, we will be talking about peanuts. I have a peanut plant, my first time ever growing peanuts. So my niece is how I came about the peanuts. She's in Kansas City, Kamika, and she has a pretty much she's a gardener as well okay and so we share seeds back and forth with each other and she happened to surprise me one day with some peanuts uh, I have never had a um, grow bag she sent me a grow bag I will show you the grow bag at the end I have not started using them yet but I'm just excited so thank you Kamika for the grow bag and the peanuts I received the peanuts in uh, a little while ago but I plant my first peanut right here 7 18 22 and it's a tenth Tennessee it's Tennessee red peanut now what got me out here today to talk about my peanut plant that I have is because Miss Renee Garden, she ended up having a, a plant and Mama Grows, if I'm not mistaken, sent her some peanuts and she planted hers out there in her yard. And so I'm going like, hey, I got some peanuts to plant too. And so that was a little while ago. So I had planted mine. And so watching her, she has inspired me as well and my niece has expired me to get out here i had no idea how to go about planting a peanut y'all i just came out stuck it in the dirt and that was it i didn't do no research no nothing okay so after i got to watching miss renee's uh harvest her peanuts today she ended up with seven amazing peanuts even if she got one being her first time it's exciting it was just exciting just watching her do it okay so exciting to the point she got me to come out got me out of the bed y'all to come out and to do a video on the peanuts but before I came out I had to do a research and my research says that your peanut that you plant and I'm gonna show you it's called a peanut pack and right here each time each time it has a flower I hope you can see it hold on each time a flower comes up let me see there you go each time this flower comes up it grows a peanut peck peck and that's what this is do you see all of them coming down all of them that is reaching down, that's a peck. And the peck is reaching down to store more peanuts. So I, I got up, came out here, and I go like, oh my goodness, I have them. The peanuts are not looking to have uh, a big container so you can have a lot of roots. The, the peanut prefer to have a large mouth on the your container so when it spreads it will be able to plant the peck so like this mouth here this is pretty wide you can do containers or you can do ground uh, you don't have to whatever you're comfortable with but you want to allow your peanuts to be your pecks to be able to reach the soil so that's the reason why we have this soil here and we already have the water 
container here to do what we need to do. And I wanted to bring you right along with this journey. And so you can see, this is the date and everything. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, I'm in a shady area. So what I'm getting ready to do is add dirt. I want to thank you, Miss Renee, for the shout out, the encouragement. I look forward to seeing you every morning at 8 o'clock. And I mean 8 o'clock shark punny. She has got her videos out on time every day. And I actually mean that. So I'm going to spread it all the way around. You're probably saying, well, how do you know when it is time to harvest? Well, as I understand, when your, your plants start dying back and turning brown, that's when it's time. I actually planted three peanuts in here, and it looks like I only had one plant from one seed. And I could be wrong, because you know, like I said, this is my first time doing this. I'm going to add some back over here. As I understand, the peanuts is like a tropical plant. So, it definitely likes to be in sun. This area, you get sun over here. There. Now, they should be happy. And I'm glad Miss Renee did her video today because it got me to come out here to do a little bit more. Makes it easier for the pecs to reach to the dirt and get started making peanuts. So we can have an awesome peanut harvest. Other than that, I wouldn't have known. So she got me out here and got me to do a research a little bit more on the peanuts. Thank you, Miss Renee. Just loves you so much. I enjoy watching your video and you encouraging me and we learn from each other. And that's why it's so good to be in a community because you will have reference and they'll keep you going. <laughs> but when you're in doubt, you can reference to your community and they will help you. All right. So I have everything taken care of, just about. I got another one here. And as, as, I, as I understand, peanuts doesn't grow deep. They kind of stay close to the surface. So if I pile my soil up pretty high, that would make them much easier to start the process of growing. With the water, we'll see how far it goes down. Your peanuts plant like to be moist, they don't like to be dry. Okay. So right now, all the peanut pecs are actually in there. I don't know what is this here growing what is that I don't think that's supposed to be there y'all let's, let's get this out something no that don't supposed to be in here okay let's see okay everything that's supposed to be in here is in here And I'm not going to pat it down or anything. I think that should be good. So, it's kind of shady over here. So, that's a good thing. I put my hat back so you can see me talk to you. I want to tell you all thank you for tuning in and being very supportive as I show you about my peanut plant that I am still learning about. I want to get thumbs up to Miss Renee for getting me out of the bed, coming out here to check on my peanuts to make sure and, and check on them again. I just got through checking on them the other day and was thinking about Miss Renee and her peanuts. So I really enjoy Miss Renee doing her video today because I had no idea how to care for my peanuts my peanut plant and so as we see they're coming along just fine we have a couple more flowers and some more over here 
and I wish I can because there's going to be another pet coming out so I mean you're not going to be able to get them all matter of fact that is going to be one starting right there it's a you can't probably see it but it's a baby one let me see I'm going on and on I'm getting ready to end this video but I'm excited but it's one right here it's sticking out it's a baby one okay and so it's actually gonna be hanging out so if I get a little a little something I can probably put a little and pin it in but I'm not gonna be able to get them all oh my the fact there's some more back here I'm all excited y'all there I gave it some dirt we're getting ready to end this video. I just wanted to tell you all, thank you so much for stopping by. And make sure you hit like, comment, let me know if you're growing any peanuts or if you have growing some peanuts this year or have grown some recently. Let us know your experience. And what else? I'm not here to teach you. We are here to learn together as a community with each other as we grow and see you all in the next video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like if you enjoy this content see you in the next video